So if the Redmi Note 14 Pro 5G on Xiaomi Hyper OS is not connecting to your Windows 10 or 11 laptop or computer via USB, like nothing shows up and you can't transfer files, don't panic my friend. Now whatever cable you are using with it, first just make sure it's not just a charging but a data transfer cable. Now if you've already tried it back and forth and made sure it's attached properly, it still didn't show up on your PC. From your PC's home screen, right click and then go to manage. Okay, on this window, just click on device manager and from this list of options, find out portable devices. Click on it. Now, if your Redmi Note 14's name is showing up or maybe it's showing an yellow error icon, whatever it's on your screen, just right click on your name and from this list of options, select update driver. Now you can automatically search for drivers or you can manually browse drivers on your computer, which is recommended. So I'm going to go for that and then I will choose let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. Now select any of the MTP USB device options and then press next. It'll install the driver and as you can see, it has immediately detected our Redmi Note 14. Now, in your case, it might or might not detect. If you can see the name on your this PC or my computer, but you can't see any contact inside the external storage or you are still not seeing the name, whatever. Now, what you need to do is just go back to your Redmi device, scroll down, find out notification, tap on the USB connection notification and make sure to switch from charging only to data transfer option. Now, even after that, it's not showing up or the internal storage is not showing up any content. Don't worry. Now, once again, we'll redirect yourself to our Redmi. Let's open up settings from there to about phone and simply tap seven times on OS version. We're enabling developer options in here. Now, when it does, just go back to your settings dashboard, scroll down till the end to additional settings scroll down once again till the end to developer options now here just keep scrolling down until you find the usb debugging option turn it on you'll see this warning that is absolutely normal just click on i'm aware of the possible risks and simply press ok now stay in the same section keep scrolling down and just find out yes to default usb configuration and just make sure it's selected to file transfer, that's all. And as soon as you do that, there is no chance that you won't find your device storage in there. And you can easily enter the external storage from your PC and you can transfer files, whatever files you wanna transfer to your PC from your Redmi Note 14 Pro directly. Hope this video could fix your problem. Thanks for watching.